Hey guys, welcome back to No Offers. We're gonna be doing two sentence horror stories again. Um, let's start off with the first one. Hello. The shattery figure promised me fame, fortune, and love in exchange for the soul of 10 people whom I would never meet. As my wife sobbed over our second stillborn child, I realized how it was making me pay my, dude, I would cry, pay my debt. Damn, so he was basically his children. Gonna be 10 of them. This, oh my God. You ready for the next one? Okay. When my dad, suffering from Alzheimer's, started repeating women's names, even calling me by them, I wonder if he had affairs in the past. I learned the truth when his garden was being excavated and the collection of driver's license were found in the bedside drawer. Was a serial, serial killer. killer. Yeah. Damn. I saw this funny video of like, oh, both of my parents got divorced, mm -hmm. and then they both got Alzheimer's, and then they and then they still thought they were both still married to each other. Bruh! Oh my god. Third one. Mm -hmm. My friend's parents are religiously pacifist and strictly control what media their daughter can consume, mm -hmm. to the point of infantilizing her. Oh, infantilizing her. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I showed my friend some short horror films to help her leave her bubble. I regretted it when every monster depicted in the film spawned from her body as she fell asleep. Okay. The jury was appalled by how I tried to hide the identity of my ex-wife's body, burning it, cutting off her fingertips and removing the teeth. It doesn't shock me that she would frame me for murder but i never thought she'd kill and disfigure some other poor woman to do it wait what i didn't get that one it doesn't shock me that she would frame me for murder but i never thought she'd kill and disfigure some other poor woman to do it also she just killed some random person and said it was the wife i think interesting the woman insisted that the voices were just in her head she almost fainted when i played back the tape and 15 distinct voices could be heard telling her to kill her so oh, well. Damn. I was told I'd be born blind, but I always wondered why I couldn't remember flashbacks of seeing my mother's face. Eventually, the memory of her tipping the bottle of bleach into my eyes came back to me. Damn. That one's crazy. That's sad. After our last miscarriage, my wife was in consolable and i vowed to do what i could what i could so we could have a baby after preparing our basement all day i found the perfect surrogate walking back to her dorm later that night that's kind of crazy i watched in horror as my four-year-old got into a van of a complete stranger having wandered away in the park once the van had stopped rocking and she had emerged giggling i wondered where I'd hide the unsuspecting driver's body this time. So she killed the kidnapper? No, I think the, yeah, I think the four-year-old killed the kidnapper. Oh, what the? I shook my son roughly as I said, I've explained to you a million times why we don't talk to strangers because my real mom and dad might find me. The boy repeated, said, oh my God. These are kind of sad, I don't even want to read them. what? Oh, that's another one. Wait, what did you? I shook my. So basically, they were kidnapped. He was kidnapped. Oh shoot! Damn. Okay. I woke to the blood cuddling dream. Wait. I woke to the blood. Oh my god! We really can't. 